In ancient India, Nagaravadus or Devadasis were women who offered sexual services for money or as a ritual, as objects of worship or strategic characters in history. Women who offer sexual favors have been an indelible part of the Indian heritage. A few years ago, however, they had a different story to tell. Nangla Viripapat in the Toil Kuvalinga, Sandar Pansunel Sari Lamadan Talapata, in the Samuda Yatala, Yangal Mari Alangal, Manisina Madikir the Gadayadinga. Yangu Noigi, Vandichina Kuda, the editor sold at Kura Yarmila, Yangal Kavidu Alame Porkada. The tide, the tide of change for female sex workers. India is the second most populous country in the world and home to the third largest number of people living with HIV AIDS. In the 1990s, the state of Tamil Nadu was one of the six high prevalent states in India. In this mayhem, several voices went unheard by most. Their voices were heard, however, and it was then that a targeted intervention program to build the capacity of the peer educators, they were given exposure visit, experience sharing opportunity, mentorship, and street play training for selected individuals. Tamil Nadu, once grouped with other high HIV prevalent states, after targeted intervention efforts, has earned the title of a trailblazer for reversing the HIV AIDS epidemic and moving towards zero new infections. This tide of awareness and empowerment continues to embrace the lives of many female sex workers. With years of hard work, the systematic efforts, the constant intervention, with all of these, APAC had left its footprints on the sands of time. <laughs>